हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द चैनल सो हेयर वी आर डिस्कसिंग द क्वेश्चन टू डिवाइजर्स ऑन फोर्सेज कॉन्टेस्ट गुड बाय ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री सो द प्रॉब्लम स्टेट दैट अ सर्टेन नंबर एक्स रेंजिंग फ्रॉम वन टू ट्वेंटी टू पावर नाइन इज चूजन यू आर गिवेन टू इंटीजर्स ए एंड बी विच आर टू लार्जेस्ट डिवाइजर्स ऑफ द नंबर एक्स एट द सेम टाइम कंडीशन वन लेस देन इक्वल टू ए लेस देन बी लेस देन एक्स इज सेटिस्फाइड For the given numbers a, b, you need to find the value of x. The number-wise divisor of x, if there is an integer k such that x equal to y into k. So here we have t number of test cases and two integers a, b. It is guaranteed that a, b are the two largest divisors for some number x ranging from one to ten to the power nine. so we need to output the, this number x and if there are several answers we can print any of them so let's see the test cases in first test case we have 2 and 3 so for 2 and 3 the answer is 6 for 1 2 the answer is 4 for 3 11 the answer is 33 now by looking at this train you might be thinking that the answer is either the square of the number which means b square or it is a into b if a is 1 then it is b square else it is a into b but if this is the condition Then you need to check five ten. If you check five and ten, it will be fifty. So in this case, this answer is wrong because we have twenty five also as one of the divisors, and these two will not be the largest divisors in this case. So in the case where we do not have any common divisor. like we have 2 3 1 2 3 11 and so on then the answer is simply a into b so for this case this and this it works now let's check for the numbers which have the divisors there so for the numbers for the numbers which have the divisors common divisors what we need to do we need to take the g c b of both a and b so the main key here is g c d of a b so let g c d of a b b uh, represented by suppose i write it as g so g is g c d of a comma b now what i do I am divided by G C D. After dividing this product by G C D, if I get back B, then it means that A can divide B. If A can divide B, then A can divide any multiple of B. So I will find a smallest multiple of B such that that multiple can also divide B, or else. that multiple is less than a and can divide a so there are two conditions let my multiple be i so if my b modulus i is 0 then i will return b multiplied by i as my answer and 
next condition would be if this is not satisfied we can have another condition also my i is less than equal to a and also a modulus i is equal to 0 in both these cases we can output b into i if any one of these cases satisfied and how are i's ranging we will start i from 2 and iterate till the condition where i square is less than b now if i am getting the answer of this as b then only i am doing all this thing and suppose this loop ends and i do not get any answer which means there is no such smallest i then i will simply return b square remember this is the case when a into b divided by g is equal to b then two cases are there one is this loop and if the loop ends then return b square now suppose if this whole multiplication divided by gcd is not equal to b which means a is not a divisor of b then you can simply print a into b or else if you represent this whole thing by x a into b by g then you can simply return x because if they both are not divisors of each other then gcd would be one of obviously and it won't affect the multiplication part so this is the whole solution i hope you all understand this solution thanks for watching